All right, welcome back to the channel, everybody. Let's talk about the things we might have missed this week in British politics and media. One of them was it happened on GB News. They're one of the only, well, one of the few, actually conservative MPs left in the House of Commons. Lee Anderson was on a Dan Wooten show on GB News, and they were talking about a number of issues, including the cost of living crisis and the strikes, and the Guardian. Dan Wooten decided to show Lee Anderson a front page of The Guardian. <laughs> this was Lee Anderson's reaction. Which says nurses and ambulance staff to stage an unprecedented yeah. joint strike. What, what do you make of that story, well, Lee? Well, let's have a look. I'll tell you what we... Um, although I've got sympathy with public mm -hmm. sector workers, I mean, in Ashfield, you'll probably get about two copies of The Guardian. Um, <laughs> yes. uh, just a couple of weirdos by it. So what we normally do, if you see one of these floating around, is we just rip it up like that. <laughs> rip The Guardian up. And just throw it on the floor because that's that's where it belongs. <laughs> Absolutely brilliant. And um, one of the good things about um, people like Lee Anderson as MPs in Parliament is they are straightforward and they, they they don't really mess about and they actually answer questions properly and they have their views and they have the convictions. You could agree with everything they say, they could disagree with everything they say, or fifty fifty. But apparently, when it comes to the political left, the so-called tolerance left. They don't really get nuanced. They don't really get the fact that you can still technically agree with some of the stuff that somebody would say. But no, they are all Puritan. Everything is black and white. Everything is hot and cold. And because, you know, while someone like Lee Anderson is actually fighting for uh, the working classes in Ashford, they're saying, well, no, no, because he also said this. He also wants Brexit or he also wants that. Then he's the devil. We have to go after him. But he doesn't give up. And he's there recently joined uh, Twitter a few weeks ago. And Lee Anderson already is one of the most popular and one of the funniest uh, and outspoken uh, uh, Twitter users as a politician that we've had in this country. <laughs> in, in a way, he's becoming the Donald Trump of the um, UK Twitter, political Twitter. And, and it's a compliment. That is supposed to be a compliment. Unless you're a, a left-wing weirdo guardian eat, a, a reader, uh, then then yes, it's not a compliment. Anyway, we're going to take a break. We're going to come back in half an hour. We have a number of updates for you guys, including uh, the other things that we missed that happened this week at uh, the World Economic Forum Conference in Davos. Subscribe to the channel. I'm Maya Tusi and we are the media.